So what I want to do is I want to demonstrate the removal of a hearing aid battery. Very small, the smallest hearing aid battery that you can find. I want to actually use myself as a model here and we're going to just drop the hearing aid battery in my ear and um, then we're going to use one of these tools here to remove it. This actually is, uh, is on a flexible tip. This magnet, they're rare earth magnets. They're, they're actually pretty powerful little magnets and you can get these at any auto parts store. If you don't have those, uh, but I would recommend that we get them, uh, you can basically get your pacer magnet, all right? Take your pacer magnet and, um, and then magnetize either a screwdriver, something that will fit into like an ear canal. Uh, it's not as strong as one of these rare earth magnets. This is a rare earth magnet too, but this is kind of like secondarily magnetized. Actually, someone will say, well, what about reusing these tools? I mean, this, they're not clean. I don't want someone else's uh, germs in my ear. So, but you can actually take a glove, you can do a sterile glove, but the ear, the ear or the nose is not a very sterile environment. So you can actually put a clean glove on it. And, and does that work? Yep, see, it works. You're gonna do this? Yeah. You ready? I'm ready. Okay, good. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna lay my head uh, down on the gurney and, and then your job will be to uh, drop this battery in my ear, you know, shake that helix around, the tragus around, make sure it's down there, seated down there good, and then we're gonna see if this will come out. Okay. All right, let's go. All right. All right, it feels like it's down there. Good, good, all right. All right, now we're gonna go for it. Snap, pop, I heard it. Very easy. Very easy. Okay, now let's, let's go ahead, we'll take this off now. And we're gonna do this again. Um, I, wanna, I wanna try that now, just using, using a glove. So you want to reuse the tool and you just worry about hygiene. So let's let's go ahead and do this again. And then after that, we're going to go ahead and use the pacer magnet with the secondarily magnetized forceps. Okay. okay? All right. Here we go again. Has it been there pretty good? I think so. All right. Yep, I heard a snap. Got it? Okay, good, good. Interestingly, this does not get deep into my ear. It gets halfway. But because of the beauty of these strong magnets, you just have to get close to the, to the uh, battery or the metal object and it attracts it, all right? So this time around, we're gonna go ahead and use the pacer magnet. And, uh, and so we'll, now th again, this doesn't have as much force you have to be a little bit more ginger in pulling it out because it, you can drop it back in because the magnetism is not as strong as this. Okay? okay? All right, so let's go ahead and do it again. And you can use a screwdriver, uh, any, anything that is fairly narrow. There you go. I heard it. I heard it jump out? Yeah, it worked great.